double that baby. We doubled. Growing Beer TV is brought to you by Bass Pro Shops. Also by Reconics, Trophy Rock, Muddy Outdoors, Non-Typical Wildlife Solution, Eagle Seed, Nikon, Winchester, Redneck Hunting Blind, Dead Downwind, Record Rack, Antler Dirt, Lacrosse Footwear, Set Master, Blood Sport Arrows, and Prime Bows by G5. We were blessed with cooler temperatures this past week here at the Proving Grounds. We're on the backside of a front, and as often happens on the backside of a front, the wind was out of the east. With an east wind forecast and the knowledge we gained from just checking our reconnaissance cameras, we were very confident we would see some deer. October 8th in the first afternoon has been cool enough to wear a jacket. Got a great reconnaissance pattern of does and fawns coming out in the field, and a couple of hit-lister bucks in the area. This day is perfect for the wind tonight, so I'm really excited to see who shows up. Using the Reconnex option of time lapse, we knew that we had several dozen fawns using Boom Palm Powerline food plot, and other cameras in the area had sown some shooter bucks, but they were all active after dark. About 40 minutes later, we caught more movement as some more deer entered the plot. Not only does my family really appreciate the venison, but harvesting does is a great management tool and let's face it, great practice for when we get closer to the rut and the big boys start moving during daylight hours. You know, harvesting does is just one way to prepare for the rut, but another way is to make sure we're getting the best data possible so we can track these mature and super smart bucks. 
You may remember recently we brought up this redneck blind at Raleigh's field to help us monitor the entire field while we're hunting. Well now we're going to use this little attachment, reconnaissance camera, and we're going to monitor the whole field even when we're not hunting. So with a few simple tools, a drill, and a socket set, we're going to have this attached and be scouting 24-7. So as you've heard us say before, since building this food plot, we've struggled to find an effective way to hunt it and scout it. But by putting up the redneck blind, we've covered both those problems. I'd like to introduce two new pro staffers for Growing Deer TV, Seth Harker and Aaron Kicklider. These guys are accomplished hunters and they've been filming their hunts just for family enjoyment for a number of years. Seth and Aaron have been scouting and found a white oak tree raining acorns in a small clover food plot. Even with all that, I don't think they were expecting the first deer they saw in the field that afternoon to be one of their shooter bucks. Man, this white oak out here is raining acorns. Seth and Aaron were still up in a tree and kind of reliving the hunt and watching the footage on the camera when one of them thought they heard some more deer approaching the field. Now you know these guys are true buddies as Seth volunteers his bow to Aaron because Aaron's on the camera and got the only buck tag left in the tree. It's important to note that these guys have been hunting together a long time and Aaron had shot Seth's bow before, so he wasn't going in cold to a living target. Yeah. 
We double scored. We doubled up, baby. We doubled up. Smoke, smoke, smoke that there. Son, he is dead. And it's all being recorded right here. That Aaron. For not even expecting to even shoot a deer tonight and then kill a hundred and I don't know how much. That's a hundred and forty. See the deer? got on two tonight. We got her done, Southern Missouri. Got Trace here. He found all the blood tonight. And uh, just a great time, something I'll never forget. I welcome Seth and Aaron to the Growing Deer team, and I sure look forward to watching future hunts as they chase Southern Missouri bucks. I hope you have a chance to chase some bucks this week and get out and enjoy the beauty of the creation. But most importantly, take some time and listen to what the creator is saying to you. Thanks for watching Growing Deer. TV. Well, now we're going to bring up this. Oh, I'll get it. Or what we are using it for to attach a redneck. But we're still trying some new tools and new techniques to improve our hunting. Hated the ending. Hated it. And be scouting 24 7. Ooh!